Everybody watching you in those days have said that's the kid who's going to really make it big. Well, I think Herbert Gutfeller, who was the old scrum half down at Wakefield at that time, uh, he used to watch Don at Charleston and Peter at Charleston. Uh, and he once brought Don down here at Wakefield and mm. the committee said, I want you to have three trials. And mm. Herbert said, no, you sign him on my, my recommendations. And they didn't do. So he went to Featherstone and signed on with Featherstone without having trials. Mm. And I think it was Herbert who said, you've missed two foxes. You've got to get mm. the third one. And Wakefield did when I was 16. Did you ever, um, when you were 15, you say you left school. Did you go down the mine at first when, you I, know, like many members of your family would have done in I, those days? I worked on the pit top as an apprentice fitter. Right, okay. I went down to Snydell uh, for an interview. I wanted to be a joiner like my brother Don, mm. but there was no uh, apprentice sch apprenticeship schemes then. Right. So they asked me to be an apprentice fitter, and so I started mm. learning the trade on the pit top at, at Snydell. And how many years did you, you know, remain in that role? I stayed on, in the, on the pit top about two years, and then uh, I went down the mines mm. doing some fitting with the pipe fitters and the fitters. And, uh, Tough job. I was there till about... 20 years of age. Right, by which time you were an international I rugby was a, player. Yeah.